talking about water heights and being a growing problem in Stockton waterways last night. And today, the state and the Port of Stockton are doing something about it. KCRA 3's Melinda Mays alive in Stockton right now with more on this weed removal. Where do you start, Melinda? Well, take a look at this. It's not just a few weeds we're talking about. This is a green blanket of weeds. It's actually hard to believe that that's Stockton's waterfront underneath that green blanket. But the city has asked for help from the state and from the Port of Stockton, and cleanup is underway. This hyacinth is being harvested out of the waterways of Stockton. The fast growing weed is a big problem for boaters and for business at Stockton's marinas. When we get to this point, it really it really grinds boating down to a halt. Can you launch your boat in this mess? It's this is not good. And it's no good for business at the Port of Stockton. I've been in contact with the Port of Stockton, and as you know, the Port of Stockton, their whole business is, is cargo ships um, coming into downtown Stockton. These huge bunches of hyacinth pick up on cargo ships' radar. They don't know what it is. It's dark. Is that a bunch of plants? Maybe it's a fishing boat. So it disrupts the, the traffic of the large ships. The port has hired contractors to clean the waterways, while the State Department of Boats and Waterways is spraying to kill the weeds. The state says it will continue to spray until the end of next month. It appears worse than I saw it last year. Voters say this is the worst they have seen this hyacinth, and the state says the drought with lower water levels and warm temperatures is to blame. One of our most uh, successful stories is the Stockton downtown waterfront, so we need to keep it clean. We sure do need to keep it clean. You can look, these boats look like they're parked on top of the weeds, but again, there is water under there. The state says this weed has never been eradicated anywhere in the world, so the program focuses on controlling it. However, San Joaquin County Supervisor Larry Rustaller is going to Washington, D.C. next week to meet with the Secretary, or excuse me, with the Agri Secretary of Agriculture to um, ask for some federal funding to get rid of this problem right away. Meanwhile, Rain will continue here tomorrow. Live in Stockton, I'm Melinda Meza, KCRA 3 News. All right, Melinda, thank you.